Lassie, the world's most famous dog, and Red Heart, America's favorite dog food, team up for The Lassie Show. Yes, from Hollywood, it's The Lassie Show, transcribed by John Morrell and Company, makers of three-flavor Red Heart. And here is Metro-Goldwyn-Mayer's lovable motion picture star, Lassie, in person. <laughs> Lassie is fed Red Heart exclusively, and Lassie's vigorous bark, strong body, and fine glossy coat are positive proof that Red Heart helps keep dogs healthy and happy. Lassie speaks for Red Heart. All three wonderful flavors. And now to introduce our story, here is Lassie's owner and trainer, Rudd Weatherwax. Thank you, Charlie, and hello, everyone. Well, today, Lassie plays a part of a dog named Nipper in a musical story entitled Mule Train. And we're happy to have with us, our, again, our favorite singing star, Ken Carson. <laughs> Jim crack corn and I don't care. Jimmy crack corn and I don't care. Jimmy crack corn and I don't care. Old mass has gone away. Oh, you like that old tune, Nipper? I kind of kind of thought you would. <laughs> what do you want, another one? Well, let me see now. Let me see here. Howdy, Jody. Nice evening. Oh, well, evening, Mr. Foote. Jody, I'll come right to it. You know how I run my hauling business, honest and fair, take good care of my mules, and I won't hire no bad skinners. So you're going to put a wagon in the mercantile company's race to Santa Fe and try to win that contract, hmm? Yeah, I need that contract to stay in business. Now, you've made the run to Santa Fe seven days faster than any other Skinner. Yeah. I've been getting good offers all day, too. Mm-hmm. I see. Well, I don't know what your secret is, but you'll win for the man that hires you, I know. I can't afford to pay you what the others will pay you, so I'll... Uh, just... just a minute, Mr. Footer. You can pay me easy enough, and I'd rather skin your mules than anybody else's. What's this? Mr. Foot, I've been aiming to talk to you for some time. I might as well come right out with it. Your daughter, Emmy, and me is in love. You say we can be married, and me and Nipper here will skin your mules into Santa Fe eight days better than anybody else. What? You marry my daughter? You a mule skinner? Well, you was a skinner before you got your own rig. Why, you young whippersnapper, you let me catch you hanging around, Emmy, and I'll take the black snake to you. And just forget about driving my wagon. I'll drive it myself of all the gall blame things I ever heard of. Well, Nipper, I figured he'd say that. That's just why I've been afraid to talk. Oh, Jody. Jody, I heard everything. I I don't know what to say. Well, why not just say, I love you, Jody. I love you, Jody. (laughs) (laughs) Now, there, that's all we need. I'll figure out some way. Don't you fret, darling. Oh, no, you won't. You'll never crack a whip over a span of my mules again. Emmy, come here. Father, I love Jody. Come here. I'm going to... Now then, I'm pulling my mercantile load out of Council Grove tomorrow. And Emmy, you're a-going with me. Oh! Oh, you fool! What'd you stop for, Dad? Emmy, this here is Wakaroosa Point. Them there is Wakaroosa Creek and Ottaway Creek. That ridge between them is called the narrow. That's where we're supposed to cross. Then why don't we cross? It looks easy to me. Because that stuff you see ain't very solid ground. That's black mud. I'm giving these here rat tails a breather. Then I'm going to send them at the narrows at trotting. That way, maybe we'll get across without bogging down. Oh, Father, you shouldn't have been so obstinate. You should have let Jody Michaels drive for you. I told you not to mention that varmint's name. I'll sit back. Here we go. Get up, you. Get in there! Up you! Get you! Hey, you! Hey! Hang on, daughter! Here comes the mud! Get up there! Get along in there! Get you! Get up there! Hey, you! Hey, you! That damn son of a sick! Get going there! Well, God bless your early hide! Get up there! Oh, Dad, burn it, we... Oh, we come nigh to making it. Another 20 feet. 
Why, the leaders are on hard ground and them vermins quit pulling. Now, if them others well, see... It might as well be 20 miles as well as 20 feet. Hey, get up there. Get up. Oh, God, son, we got a balky mule. Now, look at that. That off leaders will lay him down. Jenny, Jenny, get up there. Get up, you Jenny. Get up there. Well, howdy, Mr. Foot. Hi, Emmy. Howdy. You turn that horse around and get going. Get that dog out of here, too. I reckon not, Mr. Foot. The prairie's free. Well, you stuck, huh? Of course we ain't stuck. We're cooling off the mule's feet in the mud. Oh, it's a good idea. Balky mule. Hmm? You still keeping old Jenny in the lead team? I ought to make a wheeler out of her. I'll harness my teams like I want. Now get. I got work to do. I reckon you'll never get them going with Jenny laying down. No, nobody else will either. Any good mule skinner knows the thing to do is to camp the night. Let them rest, and then they'll no, be... Oh, I don't know about that. You'll never get the contract if you do that. Now, I mind one time I was skinning this year... Shut here. up! Father, now you're being very unreasonable and impolite. Jody can help you get that contract. Nobody can make to... a balky mule work without plenty of rest first. Oh. Maybe. Maybe not. <laughs> well, how'd you get Jenny to her feet? That is, without cutting her to ribbons. Oh, different ways. Don't believe you can. Maybe not. Well, Emmy, it's been nice running into you. I'll see you in Santa Fe, honey. Hey, uh, uh, just a minute. Wait a minute, Joe. Uh, <laughs> don't be such a tarnal hurry. I ain't hurrying. Just keep moving. All is keep moving, whether I'm straddling a horse or skinning mules. Uh, you reckon you could uh, get this wagon moving and keep it moving? I reckon. Uh, well, what'll it cost me? Your daughter, like I said. Why, you? What in the tarnation? No, that's enough, Father. One of these days I'm going to marry Jody, whether you say yes or not. Don't you talk. Well, I give up. I'm whipped. Just plain whipped. Well, that's fair enough, Father. Why, you? <laughs> <laughs> well, come on, let's get back there and tie this horse to the tailgate and climb up on the sleep. Huh? Ain't you going to get that mule up first? Nope, after. You can't get a lead mule up sitting back on the wagon seat. Oh, yes, we can. Come on, Judy, honey. Up you go now. Uh, uh. Dad busted, quit that spooning and pick up them ribbons. Oh. We're half a day behind now. Don't worry, we'll be in Santa Fe quicker than I ever made it before. Hang on, Father. Why, you don't... You ready, Nipper? <laughs> that a boy, good. Now we'll... Wait till I get these ribbons all set in hand. There we are. Now we'll whip. So... All right, Jenny first, Nipper. Go get her, boy. <laughs> get up fast, Jenny. Come on, get up. That a good boy, Nipper. Bite her heels. That's a boy. Ha, ha. Hey, you rat-tailed mud hogs. Get up there. Ha. Get up. Father, look at that dog. She better get up or old Nipper will bite her burn leg off. Dad, she did get up. Why, you dad burn so-and-so, so that's your secret. It ain't you gets that mule up. It's your dog. That ain't all. Old Nipper will keep them leader's heels all the way to Santa Fe and keep them mules stepping like you never seen before. Without Nipper, I couldn't make no record. Here we go now. Ah, yeah, get up out of there. Come on now. Yeah, you mud liver son of a Get up out of there. Ha. Yeah, ha. Ah, ha. Ah, get up out of there. Up and out of there. Get up. Emmy. Hey, Emmy. You reckon you got your guitar handy, honey? It's right here behind the seat. Why, darling? Why, well, you better start to play it, honey. These mules expect me to sing them a love song, and I aim to do it. Get up, you blue skinned varmint, Santa Fe. Here we come. Woo-ha! Hell, 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 hell. Get up there, boys. Come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yee-haw. You train. You train. Flippity clapping over hill and plain. Seems as how they never stop. Flippity clop, flippity clop, flippity clop, flippity clippity, clippity clopping along. 
There's a plug that chawed a backer for a miner in Corona. There's a guitar for a cowboy way out in Arizona. There's a dress of calico for a pretty Navajo. Get along, you. Get along. Hey, hey, hold on there, you boy. I bring your black eyes to the snake line. Flippity-floppin' long mountain chain Soon they're gonna reach the top Flippity-flippity-flop Flippity-flippity-flippity-flippity Flippity-floppin' along There's some cotton thread and needles For the folks away out yonder There's a shovel for a miner Who left his home to wander There's some rheumatism pills For the settlers in the hills Get along Clippity-clopping through the wind and rain They'll keep going till they stop Clippity-clop, clippity-clop Clippity-clippity-clippity-clippity Clippity-clopping along There's a letter full of sadness And it's black around the border There's a pair of boots for someone Who had them made to order There's a Bible in the pack For the Reverend Mr. Black Get along Get along. Hey, 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 get along, up, hey. Well, thank you, Lassie, Ken Carson, June Foray, Cliff Clark, and Earl Keen. Friends, what is the most important thing in caring for a dog? Well, some people say proper training, others proper feeding, and still others love and affection, or maybe something entirely different. Well, I'm not going to take sides. I think they're all important. It seems to me our chief concern should be to see that our dogs get all of these in proper proportion. I don't have to tell you how to train your dog or how to show your affection for him, and I hope you know how to feed him. But just in case there is someone who doesn't know about Red Heart three-flavored dog food, let me say this. Red Heart is a well-balanced dog food that contains all the vitamins, minerals, and other food essentials a dog needs every day to build and maintain a healthy, normal body. It is federally inspected, fresh, moist meat and wholesome meat byproducts. Dogs get what they need from Red Heart, and dogs like Red Heart, too. Yeah, you bet, says Lassie. She knows. Rudd feeds her Red Heart exclusively, and she likes all three Red Heart flavors. Tell us what they are, Lassie. That's the A diet, beef flavor. The B diet, fish flavor. And the C diet, cheese flavor. No chance that any dog will tire of his food when you have all three wonderful Red Heart diets on hand. Feed them to your dog in rotation. He will reward you with a strong, healthy body and a fine, glossy coat. He'll be a healthy, happy dog you can be proud of. Lassie is a living example of this. And Lassie speaks for Red Heart. (coughs) All three wonderful flavors. Be sure to be with us next week, friends. Lassie is presented each week at the same time by John Morell and Company, makers of three flavored Red Heart, the taste tested food that your dog will enjoy, the health tested food that will keep him in shape. Lassie appeared by arrangement with Metro Goldwyn Mayer, who invites you to see their production of Battleground, starring Van Johnson, John Hodiak, Ricardo Montalban, and George Murphy. The Lassie Show is produced and transcribed in Hollywood by Frank Ferrand. Directed by Harry Stewart, story by Hobart Donovan. This is Charles Lyon. Hear all the Hit Parade tunes on your Hit Parade, tonight on NBC.